Welcome to Virtual Open Systems website. In this demo, Virtual Open Systems will showcase the application of FPGA Accelerator over commitment on video processing platforms. To achieve this we utilize the VFPGA Manager which is a software hardware framework that allows direct allocation of accelerators to applications, sharing of accelerators between different applications, orchestration of hardware acceleration resources, Use cases for this framework include databases, big data analytics, high performance computing, network function virtualization, and others. The demo consists of a host server, a Vertex 7 FPGA acceleration card attached to the server through PCI Express. The FPGA also contains the VFPGA manager framework. Inside the host server, we are running two virtual machines. These virtual machines stream a video to the FPGA. The processed video is sent to the web interface. We will start the demo by having two virtual machines streaming black and white videos to the FPGA. The VM1 is streaming to the image processor and VM2 streams to the pass through which performs no processing. The context of the image processor in our demo is an array that determines the type of processing. In our demo we will showcase the box blur and edge detection image processors. A different context is applied from the memory depending on which VM has priority from the scheduler. The virtual machines can update the context to box blur or edge detection by updating the context memory. This is done through our web interface. Now the demo will be started. The demo starts with VM1 processing its video with an edge detection context and VM2 having no processing to its video. Through the web interface we remap the VM2 to the image processor accelerator. The changes takes a few seconds to be visible which is because of the video buffering of our web interface. Now both VMs share the same accelerator. The context of each VM dictates the type of processing done to the video. Now we can observe that while the accelerator is shared, the context with which each virtual machine processes the video gives different results. After this point, please observe the changes to the contexts of the virtual machines and the impact on their video. The scheduler allows the sharing of the image processor with different contexts. The virtual machine that gets priority loads also its context for processing. Finally, we remap both virtual machines to the pass-through part of the FPGA. In conclusion, the VFPGA Manager Framework gives higher flexibility to accelerators by the application of different contexts. It provides dynamic mapping of virtual machine applications to FPGA accelerators. And finally, it allows overcommitment of accelerators saving FPGA resources. For more information, products and solutions please visit virtualopensystems.com. Thank you for watching.